We started the restaurant garden as kind of a throwback to our youth because when we were young and first married, we bought a house with 32 acres in Maryland and we had orchards and we had alfalfa fields and we had sheep and chickens and, and we were kind of the first, the early wave of that blow up your TV, move to the country kind of folk. And we really missed that. And we really knew how wonderful the food could taste when you grow it and put it right on the plate. And so that was the reason we, we had a lot of struggles with the restaurant in the very early years. We had two years of um, problems, big problems with a lot of different things. And when, we, when, it, when it all came out, we finally decided that either we were going to keep the restaurant going and do something really important with it, or we were going to just close it down altogether. And we made the decision that if we couldn't do something bigger than just put food on the table, that we didn't want to do it at all. Yeah. Chef Miguel worked for us. He was a sous chef. He had been a line cook for us, and he's just really humble and talented. And it was a great opportunity to give him a chance to grow his career. And it was a great opportunity for us to, to do something with an empty half acre of land that was sitting in our backyard. Hi, my name is Chef Miguel Valdez from the Red Door Restaurant. We want to be able to have the freshest thing on the plate, and we want to be able to get people to realize that you can be able to do this at home or anywhere else, you know, it's, and, and get the freshest items anywhere, you know, it's, it doesn't mean you have to have so many hands touching it, you know, we can have, we can see where it's coming from and who's grabbing the things, like me, I'm able to grab my product and take it straight from the garden and take it straight to the table. A lot of the stuff that we're growing right now is things that are in season, like squash, zucchini, bell peppers. Um, some of these things we got going on here, some of the green beans we got going on, and then other like eight ball squash, Swiss chard. We did have kale, but that's gone now. Um, we also grow a lot of herbs like mint, thyme, rosemary, um, stuff that we can utilize a lot of times in a lot of our plates, basil, different types of basil, um, just unique stuff that people don't have right now that's so hard to get. We want to try to do a lot of things different that other restaurants don't have, so it helps us out be unique and different. How about we go to my restaurant, The Red Door, and I'll show you how to cook with these. Here we are in my kitchen at The Red Door restaurant, and I just created a nice little dish for you, uh, our garden dish, with uh, zucchini, uh, tomatoes from the garden, uh, squash blossoms, a Swiss chard pasta that we make in-house, uh, microgreens, pa parsley, pasta, Parmesan cheese. 